Hey guys, Bill here. Well, today I have a very interesting little picture that was sent in by Mr. Mike Miller. And in this picture, it claims that scientists have actually found life on meteorites. Now, you know, I'm no expert in this field. So I have Robert Kiviet, our resident UFO expert on the line, and he's gonna help us go through this picture and find out what the deal is. Hey, Robert. Hi, Bill. How's it going? It's going good. Did you get that picture I sent you from Mike Miller? Oh, I did. And Mike is into something very interesting and has a lot of history to it. Oh, really? Oh, tell us about it. Well, people have to remember in 1996, uh, there was a meteorite that was found that came from Mars. It's a piece of Mars, essentially. It kind of got here through impacts and whatever. And when they found the meteorite, they, they kind of cracked it open and found what appeared to be fossils that looked like microbial life. So people got very excited, like Bill Clinton back in 1996. And he said, oh, it could well be life found from Mars, and that means life is everywhere. If this discovery is confirmed, it will surely be one of the most stunning insights into our universe that science has ever uncovered. Unfortunately, a lot of scientists came forward and said there could be other explanations. And so I think this casts doubt on, serious doubt, on the biological origin of all of the magnetites. So it kind of went away. Amazingly, what Mike picked up on is about six years ago, it was round number two. Again, a scientist had spent a lot of time analyzing more than one meteorite, and he determined that there was definite proof 100% that these fossils in these other meteorites proved for sure this was life from outer space on material that would be like coming in from comets, meteorites, whatever. The idea being that Earth was seeded with life and life did not come from here. So the idea being you may have a lot of different life, uh, organic life coming from Earth to Earth in the form of meteorites that crash into Earth and create life here. So this one scientist really pushed it forward. And here's the really weird thing, Bill. Nobody has debunked this set of findings. So in six years, nobody's debunked it. It's amazing. And Mike found something really great. I got to tell you, I wasn't that aware of it. I remember vaguely some of the story coming out. But again, people were like poo-pooing it, saying, hey, it's probably gonna be laughed off later by scientists, just like in 1996, but not so. But it sounds like it's still an open book. So I guess what we're gonna do today is we're gonna categorize it as unknown. That's what it is. All right, Bob, thanks a lot. We'll catch you on the next one. Okay, Bill, take care, everyone. That was Bob Kiviet from the Mystified Channel. And as you probably already know, Bob is starting up a really cool channel. It's all about UFOs and aliens. And I'm going to be leaving a link for it down here in the description box and also right up here. I'll see you next time.